everyone welcome back to another episode of raft uh it's been a few days but uh you know with the summer and i had a birthday and all the other stuff i kind of took a couple days off and just relaxed and i didn't even play any games for like a week um it was kind of nice but at the same time i'm excited to be back i got a lot of plans it's freaking raining again i swear to god every time I, I was starting this and it wasn't raining i was like oh perfect and here we here we are um you can see i did a little bit of work down here now i'm not sure exactly I'm still working on the build of this thing. I really want to get it figured out um, before I end this series. And what I've done is I actually moved our beehives up here just so they're easier to get to. Um, I made a little greenhouse thing. I think it looks pretty cool. But I'm thinking... So I moved our animals up here. And it's a big area for these animals. And I don't really have any. I don't really do much with them. I don't need this big area. The thing that I do need now, though, I actually need to grow more food. Uh, I'm constantly running low on food. You can see I got tons of watermelons, which we're going to use for biofuel, which I always need now, apparently. Uh, just because, you know, I've been using it to travel a lot more than just floating. But this isn't enough. I mean, it gives you, what, 24? I mean, it's a good amount, but it's not a lot. So what I'm thinking is we actually expand our... Well, not expand... We change our animals to somewhere down here, make a bigger pen kind of in this area, maybe expand this one out, because I don't really have a lot of animals, um, and then make all of this a huge garden. Now, that would require a little bit of work. I'd have to put more of these things in, but I think that might be an idea. Now, another thing I've done, just is very temporary. I've added some pathways down here, and... I haven't touched this at all. I've made a couple more smelters of the advanced smelters. I got two. I want to put a third one here. And that's pretty much it. I have put this little pathway because I want to have four biofuel um, refiners, I think they're called. I want to put two on this side and two on that side. And then put a third tank here kind of as a final build piece. But I don't know if I like this. I like the idea that you come in here and these are kind of like their own separate rooms. And you have a little walkway. All the piping is somewhat hidden. Um, up in here and then I'll hide a lot of this piping once I figure out the final locations of all this stuff I want to do all this you can also see I got rid of a lot of these pillars that I had here before I've rearranged them spent a lot of time especially in this area I had to put all this stuff in I had to make sure all these have these little the triangle pieces to hold up the roof as I did that I broke the floors I lost some items but I put them back and, and it's pretty good. It's all kind of back to how it was. And you can see I didn't paint this though. And the carpet's, the carpet's missing. Hmm. The other thing is, we gotta figure out the upstairs here. I honestly don't know what to do with this. I've uh, put some couches and stuff just trying to figure this out. This is still very, very blank. And it's got work to do. But that's not today's problem. Today we are heading to Utopia. It is at 40, uh, 0459. That's what we got, and it is 3,259 meters away. So we got a ways to go, and we're gonna head there now, I think. I might stop on this island really quick and grab some meat, because I do not have a lot of food left. I think I'll do that, and then we'll head to Utopia. And we're finally getting our first look at Utopia, which looks just like it's just giant skyscrapers, to be honest. But it's all underwater. Um, if this is Utopia, I, I don't know. It's not uh, not impressive yet. What is that? Okay, there's little shacks off the side. So we gotta figure out where we're going. I guess I'm just gonna pull up in here, maybe. Or should we stay to the outside? Maybe we should stick to the outside. Oh, oh, too far. Um. I mean, let's pull up to these buildings here and just kind of go that way. I, I, I'm not not sure where, where we need to be here. A little dock area. Yeah, it's very much um underwater city. I wonder if we're going to have to go underwater again. <laughs> I wonder if there's going to be another rhino shark down here. Which I do want to know. What, like, what kind of crazy experiments were happening in this world that there's a rhino shark? You know, or what's going to be in this world, in this area? Is there going to be like a, like a octopus kraken thing or what? So I think I've got decent supplies, like a little bit of body armor, a little bit of food, some healing. You know what? We're just going to go with it. And um, yeah, we'll just see what happens, I guess. 
Is this a good place to start? I don't know. Oh, there's Bruce. Oh, Bruce, no. Okay, well, that's a terrible start. Okay, so we got a little dock area. Um, all right, I guess we're just gonna follow this dock area around. Kind of see what is happening. I have no idea. Ooh, little hut. I have no idea about anything about Utopia. Okay, so this requires a master key. All right, we're looking for a master key. There's a door there. Door is locked from the other side. That is someone's house, and it's floor 36. How deep is this water? Requires two entrance keys. Man, they are they are locked up tight in there. Jeez. I want I want these lights from my house. Uh my boat. Those would look so good on the raft. So this is Utopia. Oh, there's a zip line. What's next? So if this is Utopia, I mean, I guess it looks pretty cool once you get up there, but like it's not the last city, like the biodome looked like a cooler place than this. Like, you know, if you're gonna live permanently. Oh. Looks like they're hold to rotate smooth. What? What am I rotating? What does that do? Okay, this requires like okay. We need electricity. So that is our electricity, which is gonna pump water into this puzzle. Okay, I got it. What are those? What are those? There's like hyenas over there. That looks like it's running. Where's these stupid hyenas? It is a hyena. Oh. Okay, well, thankfully they're not anything crazy. Don't be giggling at me, jerk face. I should have filled my water. Wait, I can carry these? Okay, so that means if I can carry this, that means there's gonna be a jumping puzzle. All right, let's put this down for a second. Coin, right here. I think what I'm gonna do, so it definitely looks like we have a jumping puzzle here, right? You get on the crate. So if I take this crate here, up, 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 there. Nope. I felt. Put it right there. Electrical cables. Okay, I see what's happening. And then start dragging a cable to what? To that side. That goes there, and then you drag from here. Oh, I need more cables. so close I can't oh, I can't get on there okay another cable there another cable oh, so many cables one thing I notice my boat is just over here and I notice like here it's fine I lose some frames when I look at my boat so I wonder if it's the amount of grass I've got on that I might go move that just because this is really weird um, I wonder if that's what's causing this because all that you know I wonder if that's the thing our power goes to there. This goes, I think all I need is this one cable left, I think. Okay, so we got power to here. It is pumping. Now to figure out this. Okay, so it needs to just 
Oh, it just needs to go out one. At oh, there's multiple. Uh, okay, okay. That will break that. Okay, so that ring works. Comes in there. It's going to come out there. Okay, so now... Where is this? There? All right, we're moving on. All right, free shovel. Uh, I wonder if we should be shoveling up some of the, you know what? Not right now. Not right now. I don't know what this is powering, by the way. Yeah, I'm not really sure what this is supposed to be doing. But the one with this puzzle, it's pretty simple. So all I'm doing is finding a connection that works here and also there. So if like this one has a connection, like that, it connects, it connects, right? So then you can go to the next one and find, uh, it's there. Not quite. That one works, that one works. And then it's just a matter of rotating to find. These puzzles are the only one that are actually fairly, fairly straightforward. Okay, we're done. Okay, so what does this give water to? Pick up carbon dioxide canister. Yeah, they really want us to shovel stuff. Part three part of Dito's code. So we need keys and codes so far. Is that really like a harpoon launcher? Well, we need a harpoon, of course. Oh, so we're gonna harpoon over to the, I see, okay. So I need to find a harpoon. Do you think the harpoon's buried? <gasps> ah! The hell? What, what hurt me? What? What are these? Okay, so I've walked all over this area and the only thing I keep seeing is shovels. So I, it's gotta be buried somewhere because it's giving me like, what, four shovels now? And the only notes I've got, so I've got this note that just talks about uh, Lunatic Olaf appeared. Um, last I saw him, he ruined Caravan Town, okay. So, and then, oops. And then we got, wait, we got this map. It's got red circles on it though. I thought this was just telling us to fill this up. Uh, Okay, well, there's the harpoon, and this is Dito's house. I wonder... Okay, so... Let's see here. That's on the third level. Is that this one? Part one of Dito's code. Oh, okay. So we're going to get Dito's code. Gotcha. I understand now. I understand now. Right here. Maybe... Yes. Uh, this one. Nope. This one? Nope. This one. This one. Nailed it. All the goodies. Must be more vending machines here. Ooh, there's the harpoon. A big backpack. Oh, we get a bigger backpack? No way. All right, let's go fire a harpoon. What is that? Why is there a rocket top thing in here? Here we go. Damn. We're going in, I guess. 
entrance key. Wait, entrance key? Did we need an entrance key? Did we already see that? I thought we needed two keys, though, for this. Yeah. Requires two keys, so that's only one. Huh. Alright. Okay, so I have a story to tell you guys. So I'm wandering around the island, right? Trying to find, is there another puzzle? I hear people talking. There's people in here talking. I can hear them. And we looked at this as soon as we got on the island. Our boat's right over here. First thing we saw was this. Well, if I looked down, <laughs> there's a note and a key. Do not trust Olaf. When you arrive here, he took his word, he exploited us. To anyone reading this, Olaf should be kept should be up in the marketplace. Beware of his rabbit. His rabbit beasts are nothing. Please take the master key from him. Set us free. Oh, these people are trapped in here? No way. Don't worry, people of Utopia. We will we will save you eventually. All right, we're going to find Olaf. Wait, 12th floor? The other building said 36. Oh, I mean, wait, that doesn't make sense. Oh, I'm an idiot. It's on the 12th floor. It's on the third. Hmm. Never mind. I remember how elevators work now. Don't worry. It it's just on the 36th floor. I understand. Use. What does that do? Do I do I want this up here? Wait. Requires a cog wheel. Wait, who's that? Is that Olaf? Is he the guy I'm not supposed to trust? A hammer? Oh yeah, jump, jumping puzzle. Yeah, okay, I understand, yep. No! Okay, we made it through that. That's the worst puzzle so far. I hate parkour. Hey, hammer. Imagine that, I was looking for the hammer. Wait, requires a cogwheel. I don't have any cogwheels. Don't tell me I have to go through that again. All right, we're going in to see this guy. I will only say this once. Leave on your raft. Leave Utopia to me, or else the forward scouts end with you. The forward scouts? Who are the, what? Where are you running, man? Okay, there's some cogwheels. Uh, one, two, three, four. What? What? I can't. I can't jump while carrying this. Oh my lanta. Okay, what did that do? Okay, so this requires a cogwheel. Come on. This requires a cogwheel, so I need to get I need to bring this up to this level. So this is level two. Level two doesn't have anything on it. 
So let's go with three. What is that? Too high. Yaha. These puzzles are getting a little crazy. Look around. Whoa. The filthy rafters turned luxury apartments into a scrapyard. Relieving them of the responsibility was the only decent thing I could do for them. I can't believe how ungrateful all of you are. I, I totally just used a healing solve there when I meant to when I meant to eat. Uh oh, it's the same kind of puzzle. There we go. Uh, where does this cog wheel go? Right there. Oh, so now I can go like this and put a cog wheel on that thing. Do I then have to ride or uh, go through that parkour puzzle again, though? I think I do. Because I can't. Oh, no. If I go over there and I do this puzzle again and I find there was a way. Wait, can I just. Somebody can go through here. Oh. All right, I'm going to do it again. And if I find out that there's a hole there. If I find out there was a better way and I completely just spaced on on uh, being able to skip this thing, I'm going to be a little upset with myself. I swear, if I fall off this ledge now, I'm going to be upset. I spent a way more time than I want to admit getting back over here. That That is probably the worst puzzle. Um, my parkour skills did not work very good. Does this work now? Oh, we're going up. Okay, let's just do that. Just won't listen. So fine, have it your way. Welcome to Utopia. I don't like the music, man. Can I shoot you? Wah! I don't know if I shot him. If it did anything, I don't think it did. Uh, okay. He is blowing up everything. So how do I get up to him? Oh, no! I, I think I'm just gonna try to stack up to him. Maybe, okay, maybe not. Okay, I literally can't get through. Stop throwing that where I need coins. I need him to stop throwing the stuff where I'm trying to work. Just say frag out. That's kind of funny. Okay, we got, we're just gonna hide in this little hole. So, how's everybody's day? Don't forget the coins. Oh, that. Okay. Well, okay, it actually didn't hurt. Like nearly as much as I thought I was going to. Uh, I need one more. Actually coming for you, buddy. You could have left the time. Regroup. 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 Infantry. Ready yourself. Arch. Infantry. Electric zip line. Where warehouse key. Okay, I don't need that. Infantry. Does he have like an army up here? This game is taking a weird turn. Like we've got all kinds of weird, like, at first it was like, oh, you're just sailing to try to survive for the, you know, the world's flooded. Now it's like, hey, there's this crazy dude. There we go. That's how I get up there. There's this crazy dude that's blowing things up and he's taking over the, like, the people that are trying to be saved. Okay. So there's a bunch. I'm going to switch this to you. Oh, 
didn't work. How stupid are you? I am the only reason any of you are alive. Okay, I don't think I've hit these guys yet. This guy sounds like... Oh, okay, yep, yeah. okay. No, don't drag me. Okay, they're more deadly in packs. They're way more deadly in packs. Uh, this guy sounds like... Uh, what's his name? Billy O'Connell? Billy O'Connelly? Is that his name? The Was it Scottish actor? Oh, now he's going to blow me up. So if it wasn't fighting the hyenas is bad enough, now he's going to blow me up. Yeah, I swear that's the actor that played. There's more. Oh, my Lanta. Okay. We don't have time to mess around. Uh, Where am I going here? Where am I going? Where am I going? Am I going up there? The thing is, I'm going to run out of arrows. Oh, okay, well, I'm gonna die. Oh, there's more. Oh, come on. There's no way. Alright, so the, the goal is obviously not to fight these things. Except for I have no choice. I need to heal, but I can't get up top. Okay. Ah. It's not where I wanted to place that. It's auto stacking on top of the other stack. I don't want it to do that. Okay, so unfortunately, I mean, I lost one bow. We lost, well, all our arrows are probably still up there. Uh, okay, we didn't lose a lot, I guess. The water bottle's big, we didn't lose that, which was good. Um, I guess what I'm gonna have to do, I don't know if it's worth like, maybe I can use this and like chop them. Hmm. I'm just thinking what's best, because I can't, I don't have time to recover arrows in there between like the, I think I need to kill the hyenas and then stack up. I think, I think. But if we do that, the problem is, I don't know if you guys saw, but that one, um, one spot, I've stacked. Uh, let's get rid of this. Um, the one, the one crate is stacked inside the other crates, and I'm kind of thinking. Wait, there we go. I'm kind of thinking that when I tried to stack on top of that. It's stacked on top of the other, you know, crate stack. So now I'm really confused on how I'm going to do this. Oh, we're back in. I didn't mean to fall in there. Okay. Yeah, so this is stacked all weird. That needs to go there. No. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. This might be enough. Oh, no. I want this one. Not that one. <laughs> no, come on. I think I need one more. I actually think I might need that one that's glitched. Or I shouldn't say glitched. Oh, no. I can make it. Oh, my God. Why, why would it give me leftovers? That's such a garbage thing to move on with. Okay, I'm kind of upset that I died the first time now because that wasn't as bad as it, you know, is. <laughs> really, we're still getting we're still getting recipes for vegetable soup. That was like the first one. Coins, coins, coins. That was like the first one we got, or like that's like the lowest level one. All right, Olaf, where are you, bud? I am sick of your crap. I'm about to stab you in the face with my spear. What is that? Um. Oh yeah, mutated hyenas. No way. So we got rhino sharks and oh okay. Come on. Of all my creations, Alpha is a true warrior, a survivor. You see, 
all his creations. So he was creating things. This game, I'm telling you, the more that I'm playing this game, the more I'm realizing it is not what I thought it was supposed to be. I didn't know there was going to be like nuclear science experiments and all this other junk in this game. It's crazy. I hope I'm supposed to just shoot him. Yeah, I don't like that. What is this? No, get me out of here. I can't do anything. Is he throwing rocks? That did not do anything, I don't think. All right. I'm out of ammo. Okay, that does not sound like it's doing anything. Um... Yeah, okay, that hurts. Yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna heal yet. Give me a heal now. I need some of these arrows back. There we go. Oh, yeah, poison. Ugh. No way! There's no way those hit me! Come on! Okay, so I'm kind of hoping he's still at the same health level. I'm not bringing very much. Whatever I have in my hot bar, that's all I've got. So I got 18 arrows, a spear, uh, some water, and some food. I don't want to bring much because if we're going to die, uh, you know, if I'm not doing this right, I don't want to lose a bunch of stuff. We, we actually don't have a lot of materials in our boat because I've been using so much stuff to, to build, you know? All my arrows are gone from him, so I don't know what that means. So this is definitely is a phase change. So it's five arrows, and he changes phase. Three, four. Oh my god, this poison. One. Two. Oh, okay, so he did. All of this for nothing. He did hold his damage. So it looked like it was five shots to get through the phase, and I think there was what, probably five different phase types or like like pauses. Yeah. Okay. Whoo. Oh, he gives us his head. I bet you that's. I, can't, I wish I could see it. That's terrifying. Wearing an alpha alpha in his head. All right, Olaf, I swear if you're, if you have something else, if you're going to take like a Venom Bane potion right now and become like, you know, some crazy juggernaut thing, I, I, I just can't with this game. I won't be able to deal with it. There's nothing you can do. Stay away. I will push you out that window, man. Or you're just going to fall. You don't deserve any of it. Really? Can I? I'm gonna grab you. What is that? Platinum. Titanium tools. Now you give us titanium tools. I really want to do it. I really want to do it. Okay. Alright, well, we have the master key. I, I think we're gonna let the people out and, well, we're gonna see what happens. When the ocean itself broke civilization, the survivors were left with nothing. Yet, they persisted. The forward scouts rose up from the wreckage, defied our flooded world, and brought back hope. Now Utopia stands free once again thanks to their actions. With this final chance, we can begin this slow and difficult road to recovery. From today
day on, we are all forward scouts, ready to discover the next step for humanity. We can buy those lights. That's all I wanted is we can buy those lights. Wait, I don't know. Yeah, give me all the potatoes. No one ever listens to me. Maybe they'll listen after this. All right, all right. This is Dito. This is the kid that, uh, it was a kid that had the little, the rocket with the harpoon. <laughs> no way. We. Are you happy now? I am happy now. Are you happy, Olaf? They'll starve soon, and so will you. I mean, that's probably true. I am... Oh, I'm... You know what, people? You know what? <laughs> you... Don't need any of this. I am going to take it off. I am your new leader. <laughs> I'm your new ruler. This is all mine theory. now. All of this is mine. All your food... Be oh my god, there's so much food. All your food belongs to me. How many coins we got? 51. Well, I want them. So we're going to buy a bunch of lights. Well, it looks to me like we have finished raft, guys. Um, I am going to do another episode where I do like a ship tour. I'm going to do some more building on our ship, do another episode featuring that. It'll be just a quick one, just a little bit of, of a walkthrough like, of what I do to like, finish decorating and all that stuff. So I finished the build. How do I get out of here? Final thoughts of the game. I think this game is amazing. Uh, it's super fun. Uh, I do have to say the difficulty level from like like chapter two to three. How do I actually get out of here? Like, do I just jump? Like the way down is different there. Um, I do think the difficulty level is like really weird. Like it, the first two chapters are very relaxing. And I mean, yeah, there's like different birds and that kind of stuff like the, the shark and the birds and the boars, but like, the rhino shark and then the mutated hyena which mutated hyena who thinks of that like first of all okay let me just let me just let me out just let me out of here please i'm just gonna jump oh no those look pretty awesome let's put one of those right here oh i actually really like those lights all right yeah i'm gonna put this here as a final thing we're gonna hang the hyena head that actually looks really cool. It's glowing even. That's super cool. Awesome. Well, guys, like I said, I really, really, really love this series. I want to thank you all for the support. It was so, so much fun. It was good to be back doing the YouTube thing. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I would love to continue playing Raft to do some more. And I might do some build videos and that kind of stuff. Um, like I said, I will do one more video where I kind of walk through all the changes I'm going to make. There's some things I want to do here. <clears throat> for instance, I took a lot of this grass out. We're just going to make this a little bit better, make it a little bit more, you know, functional, all that kind of stuff. And yeah, I guess that's kind of, uh, kind of it. It's been a long time since I've ended the series. So, uh, thank you guys again. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any comments on that, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. As always, guys, I really appreciate it and I'll see you next time.